Hey everybody, happy Wednesday. Pastor Matt here with your daily RPM. Hey, this week we're talking about gardening as Jesus gave us a parable in John 15 that he is the vine and we are the branches. Today I want to talk to you about verse 2 of that parable in John 15. He says, my father prunes the branches. You know, there's a principle in gardening. When you want your crops to do better, there are certain plants you actually have to prune, which means to cut back. And I'm thinking about like my grapes. At the end of this season, I'll go out and cut my grapevines down to almost nothing. Next year, that will cause them to, pull, to grow even more fruit than this year. There are times in our life, God is going to prune us. Pruning at the time is probably very unpleasant. It means to cut away. And there are times God is going to prune us, maybe prune our relationships, maybe prune our priorities, prune our time. There is even times, I mean, he's pruned finances. I'm reminded my grandfather one time uh, had a very favorable financial position in life for a short season. He had done some things and all of a sudden everything went right. And all of a sudden, he was worth several million dollars on paper. And I'm reminded that in just a six-month time frame, everything fell apart. And I watched my grandfather lose it all. He lost his farm. He lost his home. He lost his business. He lost his savings. And you know, one of the things that he shared with me after that time was, I thought, I mean, you would think when somebody loses everything, you would think that they would be bitter or upset. And he shared with me how thankful he was. He said, because I've allowed my priorities to get out of whack and I stopped seeking God. He said, so I'm so thankful. This hurts, but I'm thankful to have this chance to redefine my life. Pruning hurts. But sometimes it's the most important thing we need. Have you been pruned? If you haven't, you will be. God bless you. I'll see you tomorrow. If you like this video, like and share and follow my dad on Pastor Matt Ministries.